His name is Silas Thatcher. That fancy lad is our slaver. Don't let his velvet tongue deceive you. A crueler and more vicious creature I've never known. What can you tell me of his operation? He hosts at least a hundred men, more than half of whom are redcoats. All this for some slaves? <laughs> Hardly. The man's a commander in the King's troop, in charge of the Southgate Fort. We need to find a way inside. Hmm, let me think on it. In the meantime, I'll attend to our final recruit. John Pitcairn's our man. I'll take you to him. State your business. New recruit. More kindling for the pyre, eh? Well, go on then. How'd you manage that? Did you forget, sir? My commission is with General Braddock. When I'm not attending to you, of course. Treacherous. Give me one good reason. I shouldn't kill you right now. Were you planning to announce yourself? Or did you hope my men Sir, wouldn't notice your if arrival? If you'll allow me to explain. Ho <laughs> oh, ho! Oh, by all means. I should like very much to hear this. I have not deserted, sir. I am here under Commander Amherst's orders. Show me a letter bearing his seal, and you might be spared the gallows. I have no such thing. The nature of my work, sir, it's... It's the sort of thing best not put to paper. Hey, them. General Braddock? I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. Wolves often travel in packs. Master Pitcairn won't be here for but a few weeks. I shall return him to his proper post once our work is finished. The devil's work, no doubt. It's bad enough my superiors have insisted. I grant you use of Charles. But they said nothing about this traitor. You'll not have him. Edward, listen to reason. We're done here. See these gentlemen out. Well, that didn't go as I expected. And to think I used to call him brother. What now? Well, they'll chase us off if we try and return. We're done with this camp. As luck would have it, so are they. Come along. What are you planning? To steal Master Pitcairn. What? You'll see. Now, when I give the signal, you're to distract Braddock's patrol and lure them into a dead end. No. Its residents are too content. Their homes are nice, their days untroubled. Yes, those fresh arrived are often. What are you planning? To steal Master Pitcairn. What? You'll see. Now, when I give the signal, you're to distract Braddock's patrol and lure them into a dead end.
people and ourselves. Where shall we head next? Perhaps Don Marlborough. No. Its residents are too content. Their homes are nice. Their days untroubled. What of Lynn or Ship Street? Yes. Those fresh arrived are often soon in dire straits. They're more likely to seize upon an opportunity to fatten their purses and feed their young. Furniture, shutters, paneling, wooden tiles, and more. At Joanne Gerber's. Much time learning products wooden to make good their work. You thieves and scoundrels, one and all! Fire on you and your false war! <laughs> After him! Unhand him, Edward. Ah, uh, you again. Let us go. And John Pitcairn with us. <laughs> I will not have my authority challenged. Nor I. Put them all in chains. Join them on their fool's errand. And when you find yourself lying... I assume you've good reason for causing all this madness. Some what is it you require of me? I'll explain everything on the way. Gentlemen, I believe I found the solution to our problem. Or rather, Odysseus has. How do you? Are you a new guy? The Greek hero, you lobcock. Allow me to explain. We enter Silas' fort under the pretext of kinship. Once inside, we spring our trap, free the captives, and kill the slaver. <laughs> dodgy, dodgy. I like it. Then. Let us begin. First, we need to find ourselves a convoy.
Convoy should be here soon. We'll attack on my signal. Understood, sir. If we time this right, we can catch them all unawares. Williams serve as vanguard. Let no man reach us. What about me? You and John will follow from a distance and keep watch over us. I'll signal you when I have need of your services. We're here to help you, along with those held inside Southgate Fort. Free me. Not until we're inside the gate. I can't chance an inspection of the gate going wrong. I'll see you safe. You have my word. Do you know anything of Silas' operation? How many men we might expect? The nature of their defenses? You must be rather important to him if you were given your own escort. Sir, we've enemies ahead. Shall I engage them? No. Let Jonathan and Thomas take care of it. As you wish. I wish you'd trust us. Though I suppose it's only natural for you to be wary. So be it. On your guard, man. Fresh meat, eh? Of course. Yeah. Only say the word, and I'll cut them down. One moment, then. Me and you. Engage the enemy. Looks like yours to meet the Reaper. All clear. Good evening, gentlemen. State your business. 
Delivery, Asylus. Go on, then. See? I'm freeing you just as I said I would. Now, if you'll allow me to explain... Let her go. But she'll give us away. No, she won't. What's the plan? Free the captives and avoid detection. What of Silas? He dies. I know when you're ready to strike. Greetings. How fares the watch? Who are you? Thomas Smith, newly recruited. Arrived from London just last week, in fact. And you're to patrol with us? So said Silas. Mm. I assume it's all rather straightforward. Watch for disturbances. Ensure order is maintained. Mm. No if you don't know, you don't need to. to patrol with us. So said Silas. Oi, fellas. Apologies for me tardiness, and Cutter had me working late. You know Cutter? <laughs> well, who do you think got me this post? We're like brothers, me and him. Now, what's it Silas want us doing? We're here to rough up the prisoners, relieve them of their finery. I hear some of them carry real silver. Wouldn't mind helping myself to a bit of it before we send them on their way. No, keep clear of the merchandise. Don't speak of it either. We watch the gates and patrol the grounds. Understood, boss. I am yours to command.
An hour of quiet was all I asked. Instead, I'm awakened not ten minutes later by this cacophonous madness. I expect an explanation, and it had best be good. How? How did this happen? My precious merchandise set free! It's unacceptable! Rest assured, I'll have the heads of those responsible. But first, first we clean up this mess! Seal the fort, kill any who try to escape. I don't care if they be one of us or one of them. To approach the gate is to be made a corpse. Am I understood? Push them back! Go on, Hatham. We'll hold back the guard while you deal with Silas. Stop the interloper! Glad to have you He's with me. The one I could use some help. Kill him. I'll fillet you like a god. Kill the intruders! Who are you? Name's Hatham Kenway. You don't know me, but I believe the two of you are well acquainted. I made a promise to you, Cyrus. One I intend to keep. What happens now? We wait. But not for very long, I suspect. It's been several weeks now since we freed the Mohawk prisoners from captivity. I had hoped their leader might make contact, but there's been only silence. <laughs> 